Hey everyone, welcome back to Tavern Sports Cards. Greg here. Grab a brew, pull up a chair, and join me for a quick video. Well, as quick as I can possibly make it. This is going to be our video for our Fantasy Rip League, and this is Week 5, or Heat 2, uh, I guess is what it's called. Um, if you remember, I did two the first two weeks last time. Basically, the way it works is every little, every we do many Heat seasons, little mini seasons uh, that are four weeks. The first two weeks are qualifiers, third week's playoffs, fourth week is championship. Uh, last time after week one, I was actually in the top four, but then week two, everybody just went nuts. So and with expensive hobby boxes and had like ridiculous three and 400 point scores, um, we tried the best we could, but I think I only scored like around 150, 180, I don't know, something like that. And just, it wasn't enough to, to stay up in the top four. So we're gonna try it again. As you can see here, I'm trying to kind of a weird strategy this time. Uh, I have six hanger boxes for prestige 2021 here um i'm actually only gonna open four right now so i'm gonna take two of them and set them off to the side and i'm gonna actually open it only open four um it's a weird strategy i'm trying it because based on the, the number of cards i should be able to fill all my spots including kicker and tight end most likely there's gonna be a lot of parallels in here um there's i think about four to five of the astral parallels in each one of these so hopefully if I have a roster, if I think after opening these four, I have almost a full roster um, of at least times two parallels. Maybe I get lucky, get a couple numbered cards in here. Um, anyway, that's the strategy we're going with. This is basically like four big packs anyway. These are, you know, um, these are all, uh, you know, like a big cello pack basically. So we're going to go ahead and go through all these. Let me just go ahead and cut them and kind of pull them all out and like I said I'm gonna I got six just in case but if I open four and I and I feel like I got good enough with four then we will um go with that and I'll just save the other two to combo with something else for next week uh that way it's because I think I I still have some other stuff coming in I think I have a couple blasters coming in um some stuff like that so we're gonna go ahead and just open these up and hope for the best. Really, my strategy is is that I should, like I said, I should have tight end, kicker, everything covered, and then um, uh, maybe I get lucky on a oddball, auto, or a couple of numbered cards or something to that effect. It's kind of what I'm hoping for. So we'll see if this uh, we'll see if this actually works out. So, all right. So let's go ahead and get through this one. And we'll go through them pretty quick. I'm not going to spend a lot of time. I mean, I'll stop if we get something really good. But, I mean, I'm going to go through a lot of the base stuff fairly quick. Um, and just kind of point out a few things. I mean, get a couple of good receiver options there already. And defense, some good defensive options, possibly. Got a Josh Allen. All right. So, we're kind of getting through all these. I mean, yeah, we're getting several. I haven't seen a kicker yet. I've already seen at least one tight end, I believe. Okay, and then here we go. So here we got a numbered already. So we got, but it's with the Bears, Cole Komet. That's nine out of 199. That's a nice card. So that's one option. We got David Montgomery. Jabril Peppers, Michael Jenkins, a couple too many defensive players there. But they are parallels for possible defenses like Chargers or something to that effect. And a Mac Jones. Uh, that's just a pretty good hit in general to actually get the Astral on the Mac Jones. Um, I'm not even sure who they play this week, but that's a pretty good hit there. The Cole Komet is, you know, it's times three, but man, that's a hazardous times three. All right, we got a Gronk, and these are all just, that's a nice one, J.J. Watt. We got a Waddle, a Waddle Season Greetings. Um, I'm not even sure if I had gotten a Waddle Season Greetings yet. That's a PC hit right there. All right, and then we just kind of go through here. These are the rest of the, kind of the base and rookies and Mahomes, Cooper, to J.K. Dobbins. There we go, we got a kicker. Atlanta kicker. So we're going to put that in the pile for right now. Uh, and I'm going to have to look over everything, obviously. 
So let's keep it moving. So those are all possible ones that we will be using. We'll kind of put everything else over here to the side. Like I said, basically just got four really big packs here. <laughs> four, four mega boosters. I'll go ahead and throw that out there. All right, let's go through these real quick. Matt Ryan, Jefferson, Dalvin Cook. I mean, yeah, see, I mean, we're gonna have like almost every player. Uh, <laughs> we're gonna have like so many in the skill. So we got a Tyreek times two, Christian Kirk times two, Nick Chubb. Christian Evans for defensive, and then there we got a tight end. So we got Pat Fryermuth for a tight end times two. All right, and then we got um, – and I, the other thing I'll mention is I got these for $10 a piece. So if I pull this four blaster or four hanger thing out, I did it for 40 bucks. Okay, Josh Allen, youth movement, Joe Burrow. That's a nice card. Um, all right, Palmer, Harris, Newsom. Jared Goff, just making sure. I've never seen, I haven't opened a lot of these hangers. I don't know if it's even possible to get autos and I don't know if uh, you get autos and numbers, they're always gonna be like right before the, uh, right before the parallels, like it was in that other package, but, but I mean, actually I think this is come, turning out pretty good so far. I mean, I think, I mean, kicker, I'm gonna have a kicker. Probably won't have a times two one unless something changes. Um, but all right, Cunningham, Hill, Kirk. Well, that looked very similar. Seems like I saw Brady and Carr right together like that last time. Okay, and it looks like we got another numbered here. Put this on our big mountain here. We got a numbered Tyler Boyd. I don't know how he's playing or who the Bengals are playing, but it is a times three, so it will be something I'll consider. Um, I'll probably, I'm recording this video Tuesday night. I'll probably record the second part Wednesday night where I actually put the lineup and then put it all together. David Johnson, Darius Edwards, defensive players, Jamison Crowder, okay, Baker Mayfield. I mean, I don't know who the Browns are playing, but that's a times two option there. And Demetrius Felton, he's wide receiver on the Browns as well. He's been rookie, been doing a few things here and there. All right, Kittle. I mean, that's a be only a times one basically. James Robinson, that's a nice card. Pull that out to sleeve it up. Phillips rookie card. All right, we got one more to go. I don't know if I've seen the other kickers yet. I'll have to go back and look at it. You guys have seen it if you were paying attention better than me. I mean, I got a mountain of cards here that I'm gonna have to go back through. All right, last one. Let's see if I feel confident after opening this one. All right, throw that over there. All right, let's see what we got in the last one. Robinson, Daniel Jones, Cole Beasley, Tannehill. Okay. All right. We got Brown, Chin, Logan Thomas, AJ Brown, Frank Darby. I don't know if I got any really good hits out of them. Those right there. And just making sure that none of these are like numbered or anything like that. Um, T. Higgins, it's a nice card. I like all those youth movement cards. J.C. Horn, Kyle Trask. All right. I mean, I feel okay, but I think for $10 a piece, I'm just gonna go ahead and open the other two. So we're just gonna go ahead and go all in, see if we can get something really good on these last two. And then I will pause the video after these and come back with the rosters. So let's go ahead and just, I mean, it's, it's probably not worth saving. We'll see how good we can do this week and then we'll, we'll get something special for next week or go with the blasters and something else. I mean, I think, like I said, I think I have two blasters for prestige coming in. 
So we'll just go ahead and do both of these. I mean, I got I got a few. I mean, I, I, I think this strategy may do okay, but we will see. Got Antonio Gibson on the back there. All right, let's go through these really quick. Well, I'll show them. I want to be on the level so nobody can say I played somebody they didn't see me fan a card for. All right, oh, we got another numbered card. Who'd we get here? We got Ronnie Perkins, defensive end for the Patriots. So depending who the Patriots play, I could get a times three defense. So that's something to consider. Daniel Jones, Eckler, Gilmore, Tylen Wallace, wide receiver. I don't really know what kind of a season he's been having so far. Um, and just got to make sure none of these are like numbered necessarily because they could bring about a Jacobs. Oh, there's a Trevor Lawrence rookie card. Put that back there. All right, Lamar. Elliot. Fant, that's another tight end option, but I think I had a couple of good ones already too. All right. Last, last one. I will actually I'll do the last call on this one. So we're going to go with it on this no matter what because I have nothing else to open right this very second. <laughs> so I've been holding on to these since the target dropped like a week ago. All right. Chubb, Mia Mac, Jones, Komet, Devontae Parker, Jarvis Landry, All right, there we go. We got a Josh Allen times two. That's definitely a possibility if he hasn't, depending on who they're playing, after they hung 40 on Titans, I think. Auden Tate, Mozart, Rashawn Gary, and Racy McMath. So that's some more of our options. Make sure we don't have any weird numbered ones here. Powerhouse. Uh, we got a Tony. Season greetings, Devin White. Okay, so I think that's gonna be, I think that's gonna be where we're at. Lawrence Boyd, CeeDee Lamb, got Darnold as an option. All right. Well, we didn't get super lucky. We did get a few numbered. We had at least two or three numbers that could be options to play. Um, but these are all ones I think that we're going to have some options with. few numbered, bunch of parallels, and we'll just do the best we can. So I'm going to go ahead and pause the video right here and be back with my roster probably tomorrow night. But for you, it's going to be now. One eternity later. Okay, I'm back, and this is my roster real quick just to finish the video off. Uh, this is the next day after looking through everything. Um, just going to do it really quick, though, um, playing Mac Jones. Um, pretty much going to have everything times two or times three, just about. Um, have Mac Jones parallel. Um, I believe they're playing against the Texans, so go ahead and play in that. Um, I have uh, Fryermuth uh, parallel with Steelers for tight end times two. And then I'm playing Austin Eckler, uh, Chargers, and Nick Chubb, Browns, both parallels, so times two. And actually, I think the Chargers and the Browns are playing each other, so hopefully both of them. They've both been getting a lot of carries and doing pretty well, so we'll see. And then for wide receivers, I'm playing Tyler Boyd, and this is a numbered, so times three. And then I'm playing Marquise Brown, parallel times two. So those are my two receivers. And then for kicker, I'm playing Koo for Atlanta. That's just a times one. Um, unfortunately, didn't get a parallel on the kicker. And then defense, uh, I guess I'm going to play Patriots defense. It's a numbered uh, against Houston. So that'll be times three on the defense. So that is the roster. Had a lot of cards to choose from, but uh, we'll see if this strategy works. Uh, just trying to fill out with... Uh, 
fill out with a bunch of times two and a few times three peppered in. We'll see if it works. I'd have been better if I could have got a times three quarterback, but we'll just go ahead and go with it like that. So that's it. Thanks, and see you next time.